Hi, you're watching Talk to City Hall, the program where Dayton's mayor and commissioners talk to you about important issues and opportunities in Dayton. I'm Brian Tolby, and today I'm joined by Mayor Leitzel at the Boone Shop Museum of Discovery. Well, thanks, Mayor, for joining me today. Thanks, thanks for joining me, Brian. And we're here today to help reintroduce the community to the museum's wonderful uh, space theater and planetarium. Yeah, the Boone Shop Museum of Discovery is one of Dayton's uh, finest little gems uh, that I think more people need to be aware of. And they've invested money in their planetarium uh, movie theater here to, so that you can watch movies in three dimension. And uh, when you come here, they'll give you these neat little 3D glasses which have a transmitter and they flash lights. And I understand the shows are pretty spectacular, so definitely check it out. Uh, it's a great opportunity to see one of Dayton's finest gems. And that's some great uh, family entertainment for people in the region. Absolutely, and, and education too. Right. And our viewers can get more information at boonshopmuseum.org. Right. Well, spring is sprung. There's a lot going on around town. And recently, of course, Dayton hosted President Obama and Prime Minister Cameron for the first four. Yes, yes. They were here for the basketball game, uh, the, for the first one of the, the, the four. You know, the NCAA has had their, their event here. Uh, this is the, the second year they're going to be doing it again next year. And, and we really like, like to promote the, the whole event. On Sunday, we had the first four festival in the Oregon District. About 15,000 people were out there. Uh, most of them were, would be basketball fans, uh, just having a good time walking up and down the street, uh, buying food, drinking beer, and, and uh, just conversing. It was, it was a great, great event. And, uh, you know, for a small Midwestern city, we're doing big things here, and I think it's great that we're getting some national and international attention um, on that fact. And uh, I, I, I like the idea that we're really promoting our town. So, you know, I look forward to it next year being even bigger. Okay. And the community worked really hard to present itself in a good light for Absolutely. the first four and for the president. And on an everyday basis, neighborhoods are also working to present themselves in the best light possible. Yeah, we're going to be doing some cleanups. I know in, in East Dayton there's one scheduled uh, later this month, and then we also have things happening on Main Street, Salem Avenue, and Riverside, where uh, neighborhoods and, and some of our priority boards are organizing cleanups. And it's a great, uh, great chance to showcase local leadership and, and actually promote community leadership um, and, and convince our citizens that, that it's okay to take care of our neighborhoods and, and I think it's a good thing. I mean, I, I, I'll actually be out on a couple of those myself um, and they don't even know I'm coming. So it, it, I, I, I actually enjoy going out and doing these cleanups myself because um, uh, you get to see what's really happening. Okay. So. And for more information, people can go to DaytonOhio.gov. That's right. They can go to the city's website or, or yeah, and they can, they can contact us to get involved. Well, before we close, I'd like to mention one other thing, and that is that uh, the city of Dayton has recently taken steps to save nearly $5 million on electricity over the next two years or so. Can you give us some background information? Yes, we've cut a new contract with DPL Energy. Basically, it's, uh, we're locking in at a lower rate because right now rates are low compared to where they've been in the past. So by locking in at this rate as a fixed rate, we're going to save $5 million over the next couple of years. So. Um, it's great news because we're letting the taxpayers know that we're trying to save money and so that we can put that money into police, fire, public works, and other services. So uh, we're working hard for, for the citizens of Dayton. Good. Well, thanks, Mayor, for joining me at the Boot Shop today. Well, thanks for coming. Thank and thank you for watching Talk to City Hall.